it's Marika Lake here and welcome back to my channel. If you are new around these parts, I would just like to say hello and introduce myself. My name is Marika. I am wife to Greg and we, with our four children, live on the west coast um, of Australia and we are a homeschooling family. I have four children who I am homeschooling. I have Will who is 12, I have Em who is 7, I have Cruz who is 5 and I have Jackson who is just three years old and we have been schooling uh, homeschooling for just two years and we're about to go into our third year of homeschooling in 2021. I love making YouTube videos all about homeschool, about resources that we have found, different things that we get up to, uh, just to be a help uh, for you guys out there. So I'm so thankful that you watch my videos. Um, and if you haven't already, if you could subscribe to my channel uh, by clicking that red button down below, that would really help me out. Um, and like the video if you like it and leave any comments for me. Um, I love starting conversations with people um, about about homeschool or anything else really. Uh, so if you have any questions, feel free uh, to leave a comment in the comment uh, box down below. Today, I'm going to show you a brand new curriculum um, that I have happened to uh, come across and that I would love to share with you guys. Um, it's from Campfire Curriculums and they actually reached out to me uh, and said, hey, we have this new curriculum that I th uh, think that you and your uh, family would really enjoy. Would you like to have a look at it? And so I hopped on over to their website, which I will link in the description box down for you to, uh, down below. And I had a look at their curriculum and they were right. It does look like a curriculum um, that I and my family would really enjoy using. It's a, uh, again, it's called Campfire Curriculums and they're like mini unit studies and they are designed that you can do as a family. And so it doesn't matter what ages um, you have of, uh, what ages your children are in your family. This, These are mini units that you can actually do all together. So for us here in the Lake House, uh, we have uh, a child who's going into the seventh grade, who's going into high school, um, and then we have elementary, and then right down to uh, a kindergartner. And so the beauty of this curriculum is, is that I can sit um, and do this mini unit with all of my children from the kindergartner right through to the high schooler, and it, they have individual workbooks that are aimed at their level, but the overall what we're reading aloud and what we're studying, what we're looking at is the same. And so I, um, they actually sent me a unit to to have a look at um, and I chose uh, this unit uh, which is called uh, Island Life um, and they do have other units over on their website and they are a brand new company and so more units are being released. I'm not sure how often they come out, maybe once a month I think, uh, but new uh, units are being released all the time and um, it looks amazing and so what I'm going to do in this video is uh, show you the website and the different units that they have and and just give you um you a look inside what a unit um, actually looks like. Now here is the Campfire Curriculum uh, website and I will just show you uh, the different units that they have released at the moment. As I said, they are uh, fairly new, so they've only got a few units uh, released. Um, so, so far they have got uh, Through the Eyes of an Emergency Worker, um, looking at camping, uh, in the steps of Pirates of the Caribbean, Island Life, which is what I've got, and I'll give you a look at that. Um, it's got um, a Thanksgiving unit, a Christmas unit, a Volcanoes unit, and then down here they've got uh, some units that are to come. Uh, so what is it like to be a professional chef, gardening, uh, firefighter, uh, what's it like to be a boat captain, judge, pilot, there's a farming unit, um, scuba diving. As you can see there, you can apply to uh, maybe get a free unit so that you can have a look at it yourself um, to see if it's something that you would like to add into your homeschool curriculum. Um, and there's a unit coming out in February that you can see here and you can vote on what you would like to see. So these are all the options that they've got of things that are going to be coming. So out. these um, are mini units. They are not a full curriculum. It is something that you would add into the curriculum that you're already using for home 
homeschool. And what I think these units would really be great for is just giving our children a look inside what it's like to actually be a firefighter or what it's actually like to be a pilot. Um, and it just gets them thinking about their future endeavors, what they would like to do when they leave school um, or just exploring more about the world um, around them. Uh, these would be great units um, to have a look at what life is actually like um, for example, to be a firefighter. With this curriculum, they have, um, you know, interviewed um, professional professionals in that industry um, and then written the curriculum um, in that way. So you get to see what it's like to be a firefighter through the eyes of somebody who is actually a firefighter. Now this curriculum uh, comes as a PDF download, which is great. I love um, curriculums that offer a PDF download. Living here in Australia, it's often hard uh, to uh, get uh, curriculum, it's expensive for postage and things like that. So anything that offers a free download, I app, uh, not a free download, sorry, a PDF download of their curriculum, I absolutely love. And so I have uh, printed out my copy um, and I've just put it in this two ring binder that I've picked up from Kmart um, Australia. Now, uh, what they do, they don't have um, a teacher's copy and then um, books for each um, age. What they do is they just tell you to print out kind of the youngest children's um, book and then read that aloud to all of your children. So I have uh, Will who's 12, M who's 7, um, Cruz who is 5. So I printed out Emily's one. I kind of went uh, for uh, the middle. Um, and so this is the elementary um, one. Um, and so I'll give you a look inside. This is just the uh, front uh, cover. Um, and then it jumps uh, straight into the curriculum. Um, and it just has uh, just a little bit of an introduction um, and then a note about um, how things uh, work. Um, so basically what you're gonna do is it's broken up into uh, weeks um, and you just uh, read aloud um, and then do the activities. And so, um, there is 12 lessons. Um, now, I don't know what was going on here, but if it was my printer or I didn't click the right setting, but I have, it hasn't fully printed out properly. Um, now I have fully printed it, um, double-sided. I actually didn't want to go and reprint it just cause, you know, I've already got it printed and I just want to save the environment for paper and all that kind of stuff. So I haven't reprinted it, but if I'm sure if I went and looked at my settings, I'd be able to fix it and it would, would print beautifully. Um, so this is just my printer. So please forgive me. Um, I'm sure it'll, um, be beautiful um, when you print it out properly. But another option is that you can just um, use it on your computer. So I've just got this open um, here. So normally if I wasn't filming a video for my curriculum, I'd actually leave it on my computer um, and just read um, off of here and print out any uh, pages that I needed the children to work on. Um, that's usually how I work just because I like to save paper um, and things like that. But um, I did print it out just because I wanted to show you. But um, there you go. That's a look at the um, contents page that we were just um, looking at. So I think it just might be my, I just haven't printed it right. It hasn't been on the right settings. Um, but as you can see there, there are 12 lessons. I'm not sure how long the lessons are going to take. We haven't started it yet, um, but you can stop and start whenever you want. They do recommend um, that you uh, work for 20 minutes and stop after that and just pick up um, again wherever you stopped. And so if you don't finish lesson one in 20 minutes, that's okay. Just stop after 20 minutes um, and then you can come back and finish it. So how it's designed is that uh, there's lots of uh, read aloud. So you would read aloud um, the information um, to the children, all of them at the same time. Um, and then it will finish up with um, an activity to do at the end. And so Emily would use this one Cruz would use the pre-reader activity and my son would use the high school um, activity um, and it's all designed uh, for their ages. So all reading the same and then going away um, and doing um, the, the activities that suit their ages.
So let me give you an example of a lesson. Let's, I've just stopped here. This is uh, lesson six, what's in your water. Um, and so it has a read aloud section. Um, they have questions in there that you can ask and uh, you know they can either write down their answer or you can write down their answer for them. Um, and there's more uh, questions here. Again, you can just use this as discussion points, um, but there is an area um, for uh, my daughter to write um, her answers um, and there, and then some possible answers to the questions that we were talking about. Um, this particular one is looking at uh, rain water harvesting system, and then the activity is actually going to be creating something like that. So here's the um, activity time, um, and it gives you all the instructions of what you want to do. Um, easy, as it says here, three easy steps. Each step takes about five minutes, and it tells you what to do on the different days, or alternative, alternatively, you could do it all together. Um, it, that is up to you. And so that is the activity. Again, that hasn't quite printed properly. Um, and then um, just, it says here, you know, you can draw the system and write out your thoughts. And so you would need um, a separate uh, notebook to uh, or paper to work on that. Um, and this is a Christian um, curriculum. And so they do have Bible talk and faith talk, um, which is what we love. We're a Christian family, um, also, um, included in that as well. And then at the end of the lesson, it does give you this great little box here. Uh, these are all the things that you've talked about, um, being taught, shown, heard, experienced, practice, or encouraged. And so this is, um, really great if you're wanting to, um, you know, fill out, hey, this is what we've looked at this term. Uh, these are all the things that you've actually talked about just um, in that lesson. Um, and so that's fantastic. So this is just a look inside uh, the pre-reader. So my little boys um, would uh, do this one. And so just really simple um, activities, beautiful illustrations, which I love. Um, and so this is just saying, listen to the story. As you listen, can you draw another ship in the photo? Um, um, adding it here. Um, and then there's some optional uh, questions that you can ask um, and then you can um, write their answers down or they can draw it um, on a piece of paper. And so, yeah, just uh, simple activities um, for the um, little kids. Um, you could, it says here, this is the fake talk, like parents read um, this aloud, but you could actually use this for uh, handwriting if you wanted to. So they could actually copy that out to practice their handwriting um, or practice writing and things like that. So, um, you know, there's lots of things that you can do um, with this um, curriculum. Um, again, it's just like a mini unit. It's something that you would add in uh, to your normal homeschool uh, curriculum. Um, so you'd have, you know, your language program, your math program, and, and this could cover your geography um, and science definitely, um, and even some history as well. So there you have it. There was a look inside the Island Life uh, unit from Campfire Curriculums. Uh, now remember, this is just a flip through. I actually haven't used this curriculum yet. Um, I had planned on using it um, as a mini unit to do over our summer break, uh, but my summer break has um, not turned out the way that I thought it would. We were actually really sick uh, this summer, and so I didn't want to add in uh, doing any school because we were just too sick. I think I spent a whole week in bed myself. So I haven't gotten around to doing it yet, um, but I wanted to give you a look uh, inside the curriculum and you can go and check it out yourself. You can have a look at the units that they've got on offer and the units that are to come. And pricing is also over there uh, um, on their website as well. But the thing I do love about it is it's that it's PDF downloads. You don't have to pay for shipping or the printing costs. Uh, you will just need to either just use it on your computer um, and look at the pictures on there and then just grab a notebook and the kids can do their work in a notebook or if you'd like to print it out like I have you can just print it out and bind it um, or pop it um, in a folder. I love curriculums uh, that are like that. Thank you so much for watching my video today. Uh, if you uh, haven't already subscribed, I encourage you to hit that subscribe button down below. And if you hit the little bell, it'll give you a notification uh, when a new video uh, pops up on my channel. Once again, thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.